35 and 1 Bennett Academy looking for another deep playoff run after the semifinal win against Batavia. A solid 27 win St. Charles North team is next in the regional final. The Red Wings show their might in the first set. Up 3 to 2 early on, Rachel Ferris stops the North Star offense in its tracks. Now 5 to 3, BA's Dana Griffin starts to go off. Here's three smacks for the senior. She totals 9 in the game overall to tie for the team lead. 11 to 5 Bennett after the flurry. But the nice thing about Bennett's offense is that the wings spread around the well. Daly Craig's spike is dug out by Veronica Snelling, set up by Sarah Nielsen, and put down by Marissa Tassone. BA 25-11, first set winners. Early on in the second set, things are looking to stay the same. Red Wings up 4-3. Northwestern recruit Farah puts down one of her ferocious slams. Four kills on the night. But the script starts to flip a bit later on. Bennett only up 13-12 here. Tiffany Clark sent back by the North Star net defense, 13 all. Moments later, the Red Wings are down a point, and an uncharacteristic Bennett error leads to the 15-13 St. Charles North lead. Brad Baker calls timeout. Bennett goes up momentarily, but the North Stars are pesky. A kill here knocks the game up at 18-all. But eventually, B.A. slips away. Up two here, the ball is hit directly into the waiting arm of Tassone. Her lone block on the night, 22-19. Now 24-21, it's match point for the Wings. The ball stays in system. Nielsen back sets for Snelling. Her ninth kill puts the match away. Bennett has to work for it in the second set, but the Red Wings are still regional champs. I mean, it's just like such a dream. Like we've worked so hard all season, so to be able to be here right now is just so like it's a dream come true for our team because we've worked so hard. My team is just so supportive that no matter what, it's always going to be an easy transition to come into the season and fill in a new role. And last year's team was great, so it's such an amazing like experience to be able to be a part of this team. They came out, they brought their A game. They were hitting really good, and they were digging up everything that we were sending at them. And I think they just outplayed us in the first game, and obviously in the second game too. But we just I think we put up a better fight in the second game. Well, we really have just great hitters all across the board. There really is no wrong person to set. Plus, the back row gets up so many balls that there are just so, so many opportunities for our hitters. And we've been focusing on uh, the front row communicating with the back row, so I think we really want to step that up a little bit and just focus on that sort of thing going into our sections. I mean, obviously being a senior, it's my last year here at North, and I know that I'm playing sand volleyball in college, so this is like the last time I'll ever play indoor volleyball, and it's kind of bittersweet getting to say goodbye to it but also like moving on to college and I just I mean we had some great memories and I loved all the girls on my team it was just a great season overall we were pretty successful I mean it's all just about our execution working together as a team and like we just need to communicate and be t like like when we work as a unit that's when we're our strongest